Good morning ladies, welcome to my technique video for this week. Today we're going to be doing an icicle technique. You can see here, um, I did not make a card for this to go on, I'm just going to show you the actual technique and how to do it. Um, I'm going to leave this here for a second, so if you would like to copy down the directions, you may. Okay, let's see if I can zoom in on that a little bit. There it is. <clears throat> So take a minute to um, copy that down or you can pause your video and get a good look at that. All right, I'm gonna zoom back out so I can actually do the technique for you. This is a pretty easy technique. All you're gonna need is crystal effects. <clears throat> you will need the Dazzling Diamonds glitter and it comes like this in a container, but I like to put mine in a bigger thing it just helps me um, work with it better and you're gonna need a powder pal which if you do not have one of these they're awesome love them and a piece of wax paper okay on the wax paper let me get this black piece so you can see what I'm doing you're gonna take a um, piece of wax paper and you're going to draw a line and this will be however long you need your icicles to go draw your line and then you're just going to take the tip of your um, crystal effects bottle and you're making your icicles they can be long short so just make them all different lengths to make it look like um, they're real icicles hanging down in random lengths okay after you get that let's see let me hold this up that shows up pretty well Okay, after you get that, this is where your Dazzling Diamonds comes in. And I'm going to take this over here and put it in my tray. Then I'm going to take my Dazzling Diamonds and I'm just going to sprinkle that all over the crystal effects. Okay? And then we're going to shake that off. Dump that to get the excess off. And there you have your row of um, icicles. Can you see that? Isn't that cool? Now all you have to do is set this aside and let it dry. And I've already done one here for you. And all you're going to do, once it dries, you're just going to come over here and you're going to peel this off. And because it's wax paper, it's not going to stick to it very much. Then you've got your row of icicles there. And then all you would do, and I would also do take the crystal effects. Crystal effects is also used for adhesive. And I would just attach it with your crystal effects onto your project, whatever that might be. And there you have a great icicle. Hope you enjoyed it. If you have any questions, feel free to call or email. Have a great day. Toodles.